Today we are celebrating the launch of Principles into Practice and we're also celebrating the launch of Compass app, the new transition support tool. I think it's important to celebrate the launch of the app and the Principles today because while it feels like uh, transitions and additional support needs and the way that we talk about them have come a long way, I still think that today there are individuals that are being left out. I am delighted to have this opportunity to celebrate the hard work of everyone who's participated in the Principles into Practice trial over the last two years to improve the experiences of young disabled people making the transition to adulthood and to promote wider implementation of Principles into Practice and the online tool Compass. For me, the standout elements of the impact report are the involvement of and contribution from young people and their families as experts in their own lives and the development of Compass, a new online tool developed with young people, parent carers and professionals to help navigate the transition to adulthood. I think my main feeling out of Principles into Practice is that uh, any transition is a change and all changes are scary, it doesn't matter. Uh, what level of ability or disability you've got uh, changes is not great. If you've got some a structure that's sitting there telling you put all your information in here and we'll make these changes more straightforward for you, why on earth wouldn't you do that? We always had to fight our corner, basically, you know, me and my parents. It was never just like, you know, if you needed a resource, it was just there for you. You need the right resources for the right situation. Uh, I've been through a really bad experience uh, around 10 years ago and when we were doing this research I heard that other people were still going through that so I'm really excited to hopefully change the future for transition for people going from education, social work and healthcare and just make that process easier, stress-free and yeah, better for them.